So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys I'm going to showcase to you a must have talisman for those blood vampire builds out there. When this video comes with a little twist, I'm going to showcase to you guys how you can get this thing even after the capital is no more because I've seen quite a few guides showcasing where this was. I wasn't going to do one myself but I see a lot of people are looking for one uh, of how you actually get this thing after the capital has been well destroyed how's it going guys my name is dpj and if you do enjoy the video leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe okay so the lord of blood's exaltation blood loss in vicinity increases attack power that goes for yours too i do believe well i haven't tasted that myself yet but from what i've seen i mean people could apply a certain blood loss to themselves or something to themselves and it gives them more attack power but i'm guessing if you're attacking multiple enemies uh, or an enemy and it's bleeding you're getting more power use this with the the rivers of blood people monstrous monstrous okay so i do believe this is where we actually load into the capital the capital of ash if not this is where you need to come to this crash right here guys to see where i'm at i can't remember it's been so long it's so long since i've had all well, my capitals no more but yeah we want to come to where i'm at right here guys and then you want to walk a little bit forward and you'll see an open drain just over here just and you have to be i fell down this so many times and died even though i've been down here about 100 times already i keep dropping and dying so you have to be careful i've got a habit of bouncing off this ledge here and just keep falling it's ridiculous it's ridiculous okay so i want to push against the wall and fall there and now we just want to walk you can't really see where we gotta go here so we best probably look in this way i'm gonna land on that there just like so and from here guys if you haven't been here already we're gonna activate our first grace which is just down here into your left hand side so just keep running guys and there it is right there whoa i'm just gonna get the aggro off me by sitting down okay so you want to run this way or just jump straight down here guys just jump straight down you'll be fine now we want to go just ignore the enemies people as well we just want to jump straight down onto that just like that come up a little bit i mean that may take some half off you i'm sure you'll have a, a flask i'm going to drop down here and be careful because there's lobsters down here which hit pretty hard we're going to run past this one here and that gap in the wall on your right that's where we're going and they also spit at you guys as well so be careful now we want to go right here and you'll see there's another grace obviously activate that i don't know how how are they spitting through the wall spitting through the wall jesus okay so we want to go down again just like so now that's actually the boss room you need to beat the boss to get this thing but that door will be closed and show you how you can open it so come this way guys come this way you want to jump over this now it will seem like we're going around in circles i mean i still haven't figured out if i am actually going around in circles but it's definitely different every time i go around in a circle i think it could be the same area so here you want to take a right now probably when you first come here there will be fire shooting down here so you want to wait here guys and then run to here and we're going to go this way we're going to take a right don't run towards the fire there and then guys we're going to come up here now there's normally a big guy on this corner there he is ignore him Let's run straight past him straight past him and jump back down now like i said it seems like we are going around in circles but this time guys it's different and i've tested this myself i've actually tested this myself keep coming again you see it's changed now come this way and now again this either could there could be fire here for you there may not be but this time guys we're going to run straight forward we're going to run straight forward and just jump on top of this just like that and now we want to hit it so it's, it's kind of hard to do there we go there we go jump attack will do now guys we're just going to go forward take a hit you see the flames coming out of it so you can get that flames it just depends on i don't know i think because i've been up and down it a couple of times um it's changed so yeah you don't want to come this way guys grab that pretty little flower and then come down here you can ignore these enemies if you want to or kill them it's up to you i'm probably going to kill them to be honest let me just get them out of the way there you go there you go now you want to come down this ladder you want to climb down this one 
I don't think you want to be jumping down this one. So yeah, climb down this. You may take too much fall damage. And then we're here, guys. Now we just want to keep going. And keep going, people. Like I said, it's a weird one. Now, we don't want to jump down here now. I just want to go around here, guys, and pull this lever. Pulling this lever will now open that door to the boss room. And then you just jump off. I mean, and run back. Like I said, I'm pretty sure we are going around this. I'm sure it's just a weird maze. I'm certain of it. I'm certain of it. But yeah, I've tried and tested it. I'll get lost and confused. But there you go, guys. The boss room will then be open. You can go down and fight the boss. When you defeat the boss, which you'll see on screen now, actually not too hard you'll get this amazing talisman and it really is guys as simple as that and well i hope the video helped you out i really do guys if you do leaving a like it really helps me out if you're new around here and want to see more out of rings be sure to subscribe and hopefully people i will see you on that next one